All right, Schlockmeister fans, a review from our previous channel. This one's called The Fly. Jeff Goldblum, let's check it out. Jeff Goldblum and Gina Davis. What am I working on? Uh, I'm working on something that will change the world and human life as we know it. Change it a lot or just a bit? He's a scientist and has taken her to her apartment, his apartment. It's the prototype of Lilith. It's the first one I had made. It uh, works, but it's clunky. It's a teleporter. Using her stocking as an example. You don't know already, you just can't handle it. Um, your stocking has just been teleported. From one pod to another. What? Now she's a journalist and wants the story. Quotes. No, no. I thought this was personal. You can't write about this. What are you talking about? I'm a journalist. He's conning you. That's an old nightclub routine. Two cabinets. And you fell for it. Wait a minute. That was no nightclub. Are we having lunch? Listen. Which is? I can only teleport inanimate objects. Well, what happens when you try to teleport living things? Not while we're eating. Her ex has shown up. What are you doing in my apartment? That would be in the neighborhood. A little bit scummy. <laughs> He's going to try a live monkey. Hasn't quite perfected it yet. Well, two of them become a quick couple. Just like they did in real life after this was made. He tries to teleport a steak. Oh. Mm. That tastes funny. Funny how. It tastes um synthetic. He's jealous. Why didn't I believe you? I wonder. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think you look great in this. Thank you. He did a few tweaks, tried it again with another monkey. Thanks very much. But this is not your story. It's mine. Says who? I sent you to the Bartok party to see what you could find. Your discovery is my discovery. Well, he's super anxious to try it out on himself, so naturally he does. Unbeknownst to him, there is a fly inside with him. And he steps out seemingly okay. years that I've been uh, obsessively pursuing goal after goal. Well, the next time she's sleeping with him, she notices some really thick oh, hairs. Let's try. Let's try. Let's try. Let's try. No, wait, what is that? He's changing. He wants her to do it. Oh, hey, wait. Don't give me that board again teleportation rat. I told you I'm scared to do it. What do I have to say? I'm not going to do it. And I get to take the lady home for the night from me. He decides to make a bet with a guy in a bar, arm wrestling. Sure enough, he takes her home, the actress Joy Bouchel. And he goes through again. In fact, very likely insect hairs. She had them That's examined. So ridiculous. Look. 
Well, his body is clearly changing, and out pops a tooth. And a fingernail. Well, he examines the computer says about his first uh, teleportation and discovers something. Where he also discovers that he is now combined with it. Later on, she finds him stuck on the ceiling. Oh, oh look at this. What's this? And she discovers something about herself. I'm pregnant. And she has a nightmare about giving birth to a maggot. So he wants to combine himself with her. He overheard her saying that she's pregnant and wants an abortion. Kidnaps her. Please don't kill me. I can't have it. I'm afraid. Please. So his plan here is to combine themselves into one superhuman being. The ex comes to try and save her. comes back just at the right time. But Grundlefly doesn't get out in time. Our last scene in the movie. Let's talk about The Fly. Now this is a movie I actually saw in the theater when I was a kid. My dad took me to it. Um, I'd seen the original and I wanted to see this and this is a pretty well done flick. A very good um, uh, remake. So anyway, what we got here is um, Seth Brundle. He's uh, played by uh, Jeff Goldblum and Veronica who's played by Gina Davis. Now the two of them, I believe they met on the set of this movie and then uh, became a husband and wife uh, about a year after this came out. So, but anyway, um, it's basically a remake of The Fly. What happens here, Seth is a uh, scientist and he's created these uh, teleportation pods where you can basically teleport one thing to another. He's looking for ways to speed up travel in the future. So he works on it. Gina Davis is a, is a reporter and he's kind of teamed up with her. Uh, they, they become a couple. She kind of report or she's, she basically has the story. Uh, nothing's been reported yet because he's waiting until it's perfected. Well, he tries her stocking and, and no problems there, but he's yeah he still hasn't tried any had any luck with uh, anything living. Um, he tries it with a monkey at one point and it fails, 
and the monkey is turned inside out. He tries it with a steak. The steak doesn't work. I mean, it works, but it tastes synthetic. Um, but eventually he does perfect it, though. He tries it with the monkey, and the monkey's fine. So uh, he's itching to try it himself, and of course he does try it eventually. Unbeknownst to him, though, when he goes in, there is a fly, a house fly that got in there with him. And uh, what he doesn't know, he finds out later on, is that the fly and himself materialize, rematerialize into a combined mixture. And uh, even though he looks okay when he first gets out, as the days go on, he slowly begins to transform into a fly creature, a giant fly. Well, there are some advantages. Uh, he feels a lot stronger. Um, he can climb on walls, stick to walls, but then he also loses his teeth and his fingernails and he's growing these thick hairs. Uh, Gina Davis immediately notices something is wrong and she eventually kind of removes herself from him. But then she finds out that she's pregnant by him. Uh, meanwhile, he's turning into this fly creature and he realizes at this point he wants help, but then he says, he does tell Gina Davis, Davis at one point, you better leave, otherwise I think I'm gonna hurt you. Uh, not that he wants to, it's just that uh, the fly is taking over. But then he finds out that she's pregnant and is gonna get a, an abortion because she was impregnated post, um, post teleportation. Um, although I think they had sex even before he tried it, but anyway, whatever. Um, so she think she has a nightmare that she gives birth to this giant maggot baby. Um, so she goes to the hospital, but before uh, it can happen, uh, Brundle breaks in and, and kidnaps her, takes her back to his place, and he learns from his computers that if he and Gina Davis go in two different pods, they can combine themselves into one superhuman being, and it'll be more human than fly at this point. That's how you, by infusing some more uh, human DNA, uh, you can get rid of the fly stuff, I guess. Um, but the ex-boyfriend shows up and uh, blasts the thing before it can happen. Uh, Seth is near death because he goes through by himself. And then the last scene, Gina Davis shoots him with a shotgun and destroys him. And that's the end of The Fly. So, but anyway, really cool movie. Uh, great special effects, too. In fact, the effects won an Academy Award for this. Um, yeah, pretty cool film. Very small cast, by the way. Just a, just a handful of people who even listen on IMDb in this one. Uh, I point out Joy Bushel because I have her in a couple of exploitation movies, including uh, Humongous and uh, Pick Up Summer. Um, but anyway, that's The Fly. They did make a sequel to this, uh, uh, The Fly 2, with I think it starred Daphne Zuniga and Eric Stoltz. I can't remember, but I'm going to review that uh, hopefully tomorrow. Now, I have the DVD of this. I also have the Blu-ray. The Blu-ray you can get now on this uh, pretty fabulous uh, The Fly collection. I'm watching all five of these this week. I've watched the first three, and I'm going to watch Return, or I'm sorry, The Fly 2 tomorrow. So that's it. You can get that at Walmart for pretty reasonably priced. I don't remember what I paid for it, but it was... It was reasonable. So check it out. Leave some comments. Let me know what you think about the fly. And uh, have fun. Watch it. Bye.